I was scratching my nose. I wasn't picking it. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the Cheap and Easy. If you can give it just a few minutes, actually not minutes, a few seconds, and hit that like button. Really helps the channel out. I appreciate it. We're going to do part two of the Jeep um, uh, backup camera. So let's get the doors open and uh, start working on it. Beautiful day today. Bring you guys in just a little closer because I uh, can't really see anything way back here. All right, we're a little closer. I'm going to go ahead and pull this dash out. Not dash, uh, glove box. Should be able to just push in the sides and she just pops right out. Uh, no problem. Uh oh. Oh wow. Found some goodies. Oh, you remember them days? Oh, you know what? Get rid of that crap. Okay, got me a little CD. Uh, man, there's all kinds of. Oh, yeah. Alright. So, pull the glove box out. That way we can get in there, run the wiring. Uh, so, let's go back here. Actually, I'll probably put you guys on the other side and you can see me. I don't know. Yeah, let's go to the other side. No, look at, look at these litter bugs. Ah, oh, people, come on. Throw your trash away. Okay. Just gonna grab the wiring. That's right. I forgot the wiring's right here. I'm gonna finish wiring it. It's only one wire all the way up to the dash, to the radio. So what I'm gonna do is just... I'm just moving the carpet back. I may zip tie this, but for now, we're just going to throw it in here. It's kind of nice about the Jeeps, how the carpet is all loose. You can just pull it back. Look at that. I guess they do that for easy cleanup, so you're growing mud and you can take your whole interior out and clean it. All right, let's uh, unravel this. And I'm trying to get underneath the seat belt. Come on, get in there. Don't be afraid. Okay, shove the wire all back to the front. And we're gonna move up here. We're done back here. There's our wiring. It's already tangled up. That's what you want. You want everything tangled. All right. I'm just going along the floor here. Underneath the carpet. There it goes. Well, well this pops out. Okay. Yeah, it's easier to take this out. Yeah, there we go. Now we can get to the... There's something else. Okay. Finding all kinds of stuff. Okay. I got plenty of wire, so I'm going to run it down along the kick, uh, kick panel. 
I'm going to go ahead and run this up in here. Uh, there's a hole back here. Is there? Running along the AC. Oh, well, we got to get the radium crap out. Okay. <sighs> Sorry, didn't mean to shake you guys around. All right. Let's try not to break anything. Let's start from the bottom, maybe. Or the top. Which way? Anyway, I just need it in there. All right. Well, that popped off easy. There's a little red clip back here. That's got to go up. And you got to push this little pin back here. There we go. There's your power windows. Disconnected. Alright. There's a bolt right there. Or nut. Bolt. Whatever it is. It is a 7 millimeter. We're going to put it downhill. And does this pop out? What's this do? Okay. It pops off. There is one bolt up here. One seven millimeter also. I'm hoping they're the same, all the same length. So that way I don't have to keep them separate. Yep. So far, so good. All right. All right. This panel needs to come off, and that just pulls down, pulls off. There's a bolt here, and a bolt here. Oh, got two bolts. Should have brought my, should have brought my drill, or my impact. Bolt down there. All right, so is there any more? Or is that all of them? Is just four that holds it? Hmm. Hmm. You got to bring the tilt wheel down. All right, so that's off. Okay, not bad. All right, and then radio. Uh, it's got four bolts. Let's see, we need to keep these separate. Or are they the same? Oh, they're the same too. All right, and you don't have to worry about mixing these bolts up the the dash and the radio are all the same so you're good to go okay radio should Wiggle out of there. She's a tight one. All right, so now we got all of our clips here. This is to the antenna. I think that's for the satellite. Oh, and then here's the actual speakers. Come on, get out of here. All right. So I think the backup cam hookup is in here, so we need to go get a Phillips screwdriver and hopefully that all plugs in. 
or unless it plugs in here, maybe it plugs into this. Let me go get that wire. I'll check. All right. Cool deal, guys. All right. So the wire that comes with the camera, so it just plugs right back in the back of the radio, just like so. Perfect. So then you just hook everything else back up. Um, actually, before we get too far, I want to tape. Uh, I want to tape this up. Dang it, dude! It's in there when it's in there. <clears throat> I'm gonna put the radio right there. All right, so I'm gonna finish running my wire up in here, and then I want to plug these together, and then I'm gonna tape it up. Run along the AC vent if I can. If I can fish it through or not. Come on, where are you? There we go. I see you. I see you. I see you. Get my hand in there. All right. I just ran it back behind the radio. That way it comes up with the same uh, wires. Wait, it's all together. Um, we're going to plug this in just like so. And I'm going to go get some electrical tape. We'll tape that up. All right. So, all right. So you don't have, you don't have to tape this up. But uh, less chances of it coming loose and, Believe it or not, if that touches metal or something, it'll screw up your video. Well, just better to tape it up. That way you don't have to worry about it. You don't have to worry about it coming apart, too. I wrap it about two or three times on one side, and then I go to the other side and wrap it two or three times. And some good tape. Can't hardly break it. All right. I'm pretty sure. So I think this red wire is to activate. Like you could probably hook this onto a toggle switch. I'm guessing. I haven't read the directions yet. But I think that's a trigger. So you can turn your toggle switch on and actually have your backup cam working but we have it we have it tied into the reverse light so it's supposed to come on with the reverse lights i'm going to go ahead and tape this end up it's not live but might as well tape it up so and then if i want to hook up a toggle switch later i could it probably wouldn't be a bad idea to be able to have a toggle switch to flip it on so you can look behind you without having to put it in reverse. But let's get this thing put together and make sure this is going to even work. All right. Push that dude in. That one is a radio there. Basically, you reverse everything. Just... Start plugging everything back in. When you push it in, you'll hear it click. And then just kind of go over and push everything. Make sure everything's still good. We're still good. Wiggle waggle to get that thing in there. All right. Now let's 
Tighten her back up. Actually, you know what we ought to do before we get put this all together? Let's go ahead and make sure the camera is going to work. Um, we got to program it too. Well, we don't. The little thing does. Yeah, before we start zip tying everything, let's let's make sure it goes into reverse. And it comes on stuff. Um, what do I need? I need to go get that deal. Oh, it's in here. This little fancy gizmo is supposed to communicate with the head unit to allow it to go into reverse to, for the reverse camera to come on, which is silly. You think you should be able to just go in here and program it, but that's one of them deals they want you to bring it to the dealership so they can charge you, uh, you know, eight to a thousand, eight hundred, a thousand dollars for backup cam. Now, maybe more than that. I, don't, I really don't know. All right. I think we turn on the turn in the run position, and we're going to plug this down in here. Let me bring you down down closer. All right, so hopefully everything goes good. So you're supposed to turn on the ignition on the run position, and then just plug this in. I think it's supposed to go green. Once it goes green, then it's good. And then you'll shut it off. And pull that off. And it's supposed to be programmed. That's a... I never did take the tape off the back of the camera. Um, oh boy, I hope it works. I really don't like taking crap to the dealership if I can do it myself. They're, I don't trust them and they're expensive. Alright, let's see what happens. Start up. Alright, I'm going to put it in reverse. Look at there. We got backup camera. And then it goes away whenever uh, you put it in drive. Reverse. That's pretty cool. Mama ought to be happy now. All right, so now I guess you guys can just uh, watch me put everything back together. We'll go ahead and zip tie it all up and call it good. But sweet. I was worried about that. You know, when they. When you buy these stupid things, these are 130 bucks, but it's still cheaper than going to the dealership. So, uh, anybody's putting in one of these uh, or wants a backup camera, I'll loan it to you for a fee, anyway. <laughs> All right, to the back seat, you guys. We gotta get this thing put back together. So we got other crap to be working on. But, gotta get Mama happy first. And you know the old saying, if Mama ain't happy, ain't nobody gonna be happy in that house. Okay, I lost my ratchet. There it is. All right, so everything's working. Now we just 
put it all back together how we took it apart. See how easy this is? You know, and I did, if I didn't overthink it back there and pull the damn wire like a jack wagon, I would have been done a long time ago. So, learn from my mistakes. Don't overthink shit. That's, that's how I've been my whole life. I wish I'd quit doing it, but I do it. I can't help myself. It gets me in trouble. So, uh, learn from my mistake, guys. Okay, I believe we just push it all in. Maybe. Maybe, yeah. What are we doing here? No! I just dropped my ratchet. All right. Snap, crackle, pop. That's what you want to hear. Yeah, you, know, you gotta drop your ratchet between the seats and try to fish it back out. All right, Get these other two bolts in. Tilt up, move it, tilt Get up there. There we go. Ooh, ooh, thumb cramped up, getting that old carpal tunnel probably, knowing my luck, just like I know I'm going to get young timers, because I'm already forgetting shit all the time, you know they say smoking marijuana creates memory loss. I don't know if you guys heard this, but they say smoking marijuana creates memory loss. All right, we got that snug. That's snug. That's pushed in. That's good. We need one more bolt right down there. Why do I have still two bolts left? Okay, down here. Tighten this dude up. Okay, we got this one up here. I don't spin your, I don't spin your uh, ratchet so fast you smash the window and break it. That's what I would end up doing. So. Be careful. That's, that's you know that's my luck. Okay, that sits down in there. I guess that clips in there. This goes back on downhill. She's already uh, decorating her Jeep. It's a uh, Germex. And this little skeleton glows in the dark. Of course, you, know, you can't tell right now. And I'll show you. She's already bought some accessories. Her first accessory things you got little old shit handles, and they're purple. You got it for all four doors. Pretty, they're pretty solid. They Velcro, and I like them because now when I'm cruising around here like this, you know, I'm like, God damn, I hit the brakes, you know. Oh. We're getting there. We are getting there. We just got to put the glove box in. We're done with this sucker. Oh, no. I forgot about this crap. Yeah, we got to get that put in, too. Got to get our uh, power windows put back in. I'm sure she's going to want that. Push our little red clip back down. And this just pushes in like so. 
and we are good to go. Put this in the shop for if I ever come across uh, somebody else that needs a backup cam, I can program it for them. Not act like I'm programming it. This thing does it all. You see how easy it is. You literally plug it in, wait till the green light comes on. You're done. Um, glove box, and then some zip ties. Okay, got some zip ties. Got my fancy zipper upper 2000. I'm pretty sure we really don't even need a zip tie anything. Uh, but we'll go ahead and zip tie to whatever wire this is because this way the wire is not bouncing around. And then we'll zippy zip this. It'll let me zip it. Oh, sorry. Daydreaming, guys. I like looking at shit. Wondering how it works. Wondering if it breaks. How am I going to fix it? You know, the mechanics life. All right, so all this extra, I'm just going to roll it up. And all the extra will be underneath this uh, kick panel. Probably should have rolled it all up and kept it up there. So if you guys do it, I would roll it up in there. Take your slack out down here and move it up there. But either way, work. I'm going to put it down here. Let's kick down. Uh, the kick plate will cover it. You're just going to whoop my ass all the way, aren't you? So note to self. I just leave the damn kick panel on there. All right. Finally got it. All right, glove box goes back in. There we go. And we are done. Well, uh, let me say we check the backup cam one more time. Almost forgot her floor mat. Nice. Kind of looks like the, the Beastie Boys. You ever remember the Beastie Boys? Anybody? Do the little rapping. I can't even remember. The, I can't remember their songs now. This is what they do. Camera turned out pretty good. Got a good picture. Oh shit! Oh shit! No, stop! Stop! stop. Pretty good. Oh, she ought to be happy. If not, she should be. All right. Let's see. We are done, guys. The old Jeep. Oh, God, I about fell down. Sorry. That would have been a good blooper. Watching me fall right on my butt talks. The old Jeep needs a bath. It's been raining like crazy over here. She's a little muddy. Oh, our next uh, uh, big plans are coming over here and getting all the go-kart crap and all the other junk out of here because the charger has got to go in here now. Because winter time's coming up. I usually store in here. That way, winter time, I can work in the shop 
because my shop does have heat. And I do also have extra heat if I really want. I can uh, hook this up to propane and I can get the shop to 90 degrees in here. Be sweating your balls off. All right. I appreciate everybody watching. Hopefully, uh, if you have a Jeep, this will uh, come in handy for you. Because uh, I pretty much pretty much learned you. You basically got to do what do what I did not do, or do what I do, but do not. Uh, why do you say that? Anyway, don't do like I did. Just zip tie the damn thing. Don't overthink it and try to cram it in here because you'll break your Chinese wire. So basically all I did is zip tie this. There's enough here. As you can see, I just kind of folded it on top of each other like that. I need to put one more zip tie right there. But see, you zip tie it and it looks, it looks good. You can't even see it. Good enough. So, uh, that is it. We are done. So, thanks for watching. Remember, keep it cheap and easy. Signing off. Peace out.